Anyway, uh, murderous villain test. Which murderous villain resembles you the most? This free online 45 question personality test will allow you to compare yourself with the personalities of 20 murderous dictators and terrorists. Using a hybrid of the scientific Big Five measure of personality and the cognitive theories of C.G. Jong. Furthermore, this test will also match your personality scores with peer-reviewed university studies. Wow, this is in-depth, apparently. Alright. Question 1 of 45. You sometimes keep an, you sometimes keep old plane and movie tickets as memorabilia. Uh, not movie tickets. I do have, like, some wrestling tickets, though, so... I wonder which murderous villains did that. So do I. You oh, think oh Osama Bin Laden was sentimental? Is this a question? What? No, you press next up there. Go Where up. Is next? The red button oh, that says next sorry. under I'm, no. I'm, I'm kind of blind. Uh, which is more true of you? Sometimes things aren't really true for me until I've read them in a book. Sometimes things aren't really true of me until I've experienced them myself. Yo, bro, is New Zealand even real if I haven't seen it? That's hard. I'd say... You know what? Yeah, I'd say book thing, because I, I haven't really experienced much, and I just go by whatever is said on the internet or whatever, so... Whatever. That's a horrible idea. <laughs> not not like fucking, I actually look into it. Not like most people say, oh, it's on Facebook. That's true. I'm more like, I look Ooh, into it. I found this like... article that validates my already pre-opposed exactly. notion. Yeah, exactly. But I'm not like not that bad, but I am quite yeah, bad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're like, ooh, I'll research this. Yeah. Uh, I would rather read a book about philosophy, a book, of, yeah. Uh, uh, what, when solving a problem, I refer to Steer directly towards accomplishing the goal and bringing the task to completion. Keep my options open. Maybe something unexpected will come along. It's often a problem. I guess. I guess that. Yeah. Which is more true to you? I am oriented towards closure, and I push to get things settled and decided. I wait to see that I am adaptable and free. I keep my options open. Yeah, I'd say that because I'm not. Yeah. Most people really want to help others. Most. It's a stretch. I disagree. Um, you're shopping for carrots and your grocer offers you some new purple ones. Orange will be fine, thanks. <laughs> uh, which is more true to you? I have a high activity level, uh, and live a diverse and varied life, and live a diverse and varied life. I have somewhat lower activity level, but knowing this, concentrate my activities around things that really matter. Yeah. Uh, I love spending my weekend nights at pet. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> which is which is more true of you? While I am a good listener, I'm definitely at my best when I can be allowed to speak up and spar with others. While I am a good speaker, I am definitely at my best when I can be allowed to collect myself. Yeah. Uh, the world would be a better place if more people were just a little kinder, if more people were a little more, yeah. Um, I, 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 is that a controversial one, do you think, that last one? Uh, it's the way I feel, but I feel like most people would say kinder. Mm. Uh, I more often think to myself that people overcomplicate things, the world isn't yes. Uh, people are generally oversensitive and tend to make big fusses over things that aren't really a matter. Yeah. Yeah. Huh? Mm-hmm. Uh, I am better at improvising plan oh dear. Um in social situations I'm probably closer to being too critical of other people, too qu too kind. Uh I feel better about knowing that I have the freedom to change the course of careers when it suits me, knowing that I have planned for security yeah that <laughs> I am more of a fan of early bird night owl. Oh fuck. I'm kind of both Dude, I'm such a night owl. Yeah, I'm a night I'm owl. Though, I say early bird. I'm 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 up more in the morning than I am up in the night. So yeah. I say early bird. Every time at around four thirty a.m., I see Keith Healy is on loan. Uh, I which is more true of you? I usually have a good idea about which items of clothing are fashionable. I don't necessarily follow the fashion myself, but I have a knack at spotting the trends. I hardly ever have any idea about items of clothing are fashionable. I often feel no, I don't give a shit about fashion. Uh, when a friend or acquaintance ignores me at a party, it bothers me, and I think about it the next day. I feel their loss. <laughs> fuck, like fuck. <laughs> uh, it annoys me more when people are overly specific and exact, overly vet. Yeah, fucking. Hell. Why would you be pissed off at that? Uh, I don't. That's weird to me. Do you, you want to have a? Jack? Do you want? Do you want to have a discussion? I said overly vague, but like I I know some people because I I talk to a lot of gun nuts, but like like. 
they they will correct you on like the littlest things mm, like yeah, i guess mm. yeah I, I get that uh, like actually more... actually it's 792 by 57 yeah. millimeter mauser and yeah, not no, eight gives... millimeter mauser there's a difference point zero eight of a millimeter <laughs> literally just more true to you uh, when I sit down to think about the ideas of others, I often find myself improving on them in novel and unexpected ways. When I sit down to think about the ideas of others, I often find it did not make as much sense as my own ideas. Eh, I'll go with that one. That's Definitely cool. the latter. You think? For you? Really? Which way? Wait, uh, wait, what? Well, oh, never mind. It's over. <laughs> Which is more All true right. to you. Uh, I have been known to let administrative things like insurance and tax returns. I don't know. I am somewhat compulsive about saying on top of admin. Yeah, I am. I'm very, yeah, I guess. With the things that I, that question took a while to show up. I sometimes worry that people won't give me my fair share of recognition and credit for the work I contribute. As I'll be honest. Yeah. Honestly, like when I watch your videos, Keith, like, I'm like, wow, he really, like, sometimes you, like, put, like, a lot of effort into, like, little small things. Like, on yeah. one episode of, like, Jack 3 No Guns, you were like, I killed Nick. And then there's, like, a 30-second fucking segment <laughs> that you edited together of, like, Rip Nick. And then you're like, just kidding. <laughs> like, you don't see you don't see that a lot. You know what I mean? Yeah, whatever. Uh, whose genius would you rather have? Shakespeare or Einstein? Shakespeare is more fun. <laughs> I know Einstein is more like yeah Shakespeare is more fun. I mean Einstein would be more like more useful, but Shakespeare is funner. Uh, Dude, Shakespeare do... loved dick jokes. Like, have you ever like? <laughs> but for real though, like his plays were full of dick jokes. <laughs> I'd rather do things than sit around analyzing them. Yeah. If you'd rather sit around and analyze things. No, I'd rather actually change something. Actually, I'm not saying that I would do it, but I would rather do it. Uh, you tend to be what people expect you to be because fuck off. Um, <laughs> dealing even with people can be unpleasant, but people themselves can never be awful or horrible. You know, um, basically, basically. Yeah, I disagree. Uh, yeah, I would rather... Some people are just evil. Most people are yeah. stupid, though. Yeah. Discover a new species of flower or animal. Discover a new scientific concept. Oh, Discover fuck, a new scientific same... concept. That is pretty much the same thing, though. Like... It's all science. Uh, I, <laughs> you see, I'll you say, could you could you uh, could be the guy who discovered the Blish principle, which was a uh, which was a mechanical principle that didn't really exist. What do I pick here? Uh, flowers, animal, yeah, but flower, no. Seen as I combine them, I'll go with science. Some people are simply more worthy than others. Yeah, I agree with that. Yeah. Uh. If a sign says no smoking, part of me would be tempted to pull out an e-cigarette and start vaping. Only a child would have to breathe. <laughs> yeah, I would. I would. Yeah. I would. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you. How do you feel about multitasking? I find multitasking to be generally in inhibitive to my style of working, and I can and I am prone to make mistakes in my multitask. I love zapping back and forth. Yeah. Um. Do you ignore it when someone cuts in front of you in line? And that's never happened to me, honestly. Actually, really? I don't think it has, and if it has, I'm too stupid to notice it. So I'll say no, just to sound cool. <laughs> <laughs> just to sound cool. Uh, if you could magically learn a language, what would you choose? I would choose to make it a major world language. It might, I might make it a dead language, like Latin. Oh, fuck off! Why would I do that? Why would I bother? Dude, Latin's uh, cool. It is. Although I would choose a major language. Useless. You could, like, pretend yeah, to be, yeah. like, possessed or some shit. I was forced to learn Irish in school, and that was the most ridiculous thing in the world. Hey, it's so. part of your heritage, boy. Fuck it. I don't give a shit. It's useless. <laughs> in general, I think that more of society's wealth should be taxed from the rich and redistributed to the poor. I mean, it's their money, like, but, yeah, whatever, I guess. I, I wouldn't want to disagree with it, but it is more of a, it's more complex than that. Uh, my mood changes frequently and rapidly, yes, yeah, so I have mood swings. Um, in resolving conflicts, which approach do you more often find yourself taking? A principled approach based on justice and logic. A compassionate approach based on empathy and under. That's hard. Um, I'd say, yeah, I'd say more. 
I'm a real dickhead when people are like fighting or whatever, and I'm like, will you shut the fuck up and just leave each other alone? Like, I don't. Yeah. Like, oh hey. Leave me. So I'd say that. Like like uh, when when somebody's sad, are you more are you more likely to offer like uh, sympathy or support? Like are you more likely to be like, okay, here's some things you can do to not be sad, or are you more likely to be like, oh, it's okay. I'd yeah, say oh, Keith no, would be more does. along like I think Keith would be more along the like well, you shut up and stop fucking crying. You need to find yeah. a fucking solution. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, I would rather be familiar and conser- con con conversant with all manner of different ideas pursue a select few of ideas or interests until i feel that i've mastered them all the way to top of them i'm more like that definitely i'd like to be more like that but i'm really more like that uh which is more often true to you someone asks me a question and doesn't give me enough time to think of an answer before they resume talking i ask them on a question and get impatient when they don't yeah no i don't mind when people take time to fucking form an answer like why, why would you have a problem with that uh, the best guide to human action is principles, otherwise people could just justify anything. Values, it's important to be authentic about who you really are. I'd say that, yeah, whatever, that's hard. Uh, which statement do you agree with more? I'm generally pretty sensitive to all various music, noise and advertising images that are invariably thrown in my face over the course of a normal day. I wish public life was less tangled up in all those stimuli. Uh, I don't really like all of the music noise and advertising images that are thrown in my face over the course of a normal day, but then again, who does? It's not something that's worth getting upset over. I don't get it, yeah. Yeah, yeah you get, 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 get pretty pissed off when you see ads every fucking time on YouTube. Yeah. Fucking ad! Fucking ad! <laughs> not fucking using an ad, ad blocker. <laughs> I, I don't use it for YouTube because I understand that. But that's gonna, not gonna matter anymore because YouTube's fucked that up. Uh, your neighbor yeah. is playing music that's way too loud, and you need quiet to prepare for tomorrow. I knock on the door and ask him to turn it down. Simple as that. Though I'd like him to stop, I not cut. Yeah, I'm gonna be honest. I'd be like that. I'm, I'm very passive. Uh, philosophy is kind of pointless and has largely been rendered obsolete by modern science. I disagree. I think. Yeah. Uh, I'd rather spend three days in a private island with my best friend, five promising you... Well, fuck off. <laughs> Actually, <laughs> thinking of that more, I'm overthinking it, I think, but... I mean, you could make new friends, but I want to be someone uncomfortable with. I don't want They're be like, promising new acquaintances, though. Uh, f- nah. Hitler was promising, was a promising leader. Uh, which describes <laughs> you... Was better. he? He was, like a, he was a failed artist, bro. He, like, he was poor his whole life. Uh, he, not really. I mean, well, yeah, he was poor as all, but I'm not getting into this. <laughs> <laughs> which, which describes you better? I move at a very fast pace, and I make sure I don't get bored. I move at a deliberate pace and make sure I can concentrate. I'm more like that. Which is more true to you? Although I enjoy seeing friends one on one, I find it more stimulating to hang out with several people at once. I love to give and take when multiple people join. Although I enjoy liveliness of group set, and I tend to seek out one on one. Yeah, I'd rather one on. Well, I mean, I like, like to like, stay in your fucking room and not talk to anyone. Yeah, pretty much. But uh, I mean, I like three is my limit. Like what we're doing now, that's my limit. When another person's added, and like just seems to get closer, fucky. So I'd say I'm more towards this one. The I one. think. I think maybe like four or five is my limit. Yeah. Mm. I can, okay, I think I could handle four if we're all uh, cool. Uh, apparently, I'm a memory card reader. Okay. Uh, <laughs> oh, Jesus. Uh, oh, I'm Vladimir Putin. Okay. Um, oh, really? Yeah. That, that, uh, okay. Huh. Uh, I'm introverted. Uh, am I? No, I'm kind of in the 50 between extroverted and introverted. Uh, I'm a... Uh, that's wrong. No, I'm dude, you're realist. you're in the you're in the low part of of introverted. Oh, okay. So yeah, more introverted. Uh, apparently, more of a dreamer. I'd say I'm much more of a realist in real life. Uh, cold headed, warm hearted. I'd say yeah. I'm more warm. About in the middle. Uh, yeah. What's this red? Oh, that's oh me. Um, that's that's Putin. Fo- the red is Putin. Yeah. Oh, okay. That makes more sense. Uh, actually, not really. Yeah. Uh, focused. And brooding or carefree? I'd say more carefree. Yeah, that is more. Yeah, yeah you are, yeah. Merrick. Yeah, that's, that's, that's. You know who I got? Enough. I got fucking Mao Zedong. <laughs> I got the goddamn communist leader of China who killed China. 60 million people. 60 million! <laughs>